Hello again and welcome to Let Jesus Drive. Today we are talking about meekness. Meekness. We are so happy that you have come on board. Um, we are living in a world where many individuals believe that because you are meek, something is wrong with you. But there are a lot of misconceptions out there about meekness. You see, people, even though they use the text, Blessed are the meek, from the Gospel according to Matthew, they don't seem to act out what the text is really saying. And um, I have never seen in the Bible where the Bible says, Blessed are those who speak their minds, or blessed are those who are rough, for they shall inherit the earth. And then we have a lot of people, including Christians, who go around and brag about how strong they are and how they are not afraid of anybody and stuff and stuff. But the Bible actually says that when you are meek, that is the time that you are strong. As a matter of fact, meekness is not weakness. It is really strength under control. Because when people believe that you are weak, that is the time that you are really strong because you are able to manage your emotions but when you are not able to give and take and manage your emotions properly that's the time that you are weak <laughs> the great philosopher bob marley said once that we have to allow um, ourselves and our emotions to simmer down. Have you ever noticed that when the pot is boiling, when the pot is boiling and if the cover is down, it is going to lift the cover up. So you have to quickly turn down the fire, turn down the heat so that the pot can simmer down. It is the same thing when a, when a car is boiling, you have to wait for a certain amount of time and, and, and remove the cover so that it can cool. So, you know, we don't need to be too hot. Even the car engine, before the car can effectively run, it has to maintain a certain temperature you have to pour water and and and, and the, 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 the the water help to assist the cooling system of the car and make the car run properly a missionary some years ago to jamaica was once questioning some little boys on the meaning of Matthew chapter 5 and verse 5. So the missionary asked this group of um, boys. He said to them, according to Matthew 5 and verse 5, Who are the meek? One of the boys quickly answered him. He said, Sir, the meek are those who give soft answers. To rough questions. You see, we shall do well to remember this child's definition of meekness. The one who has wisdom in his head and heart does not need to shout at others. No. Wisdom speaks softly and persuasively instead of impelling and forcing through the use of our tongues. You see, people will know whether we are wise or not. 
as that great theologian Charles Hodge said, the doctrines of grace humble a man without degrading him and exalt him without inflating him. Of course, someone once said that it is better to close your mouth and let everybody think that you are a fool than to open your mouth and let everybody see that you are a fool. So meekness is not weakness. It is strength under control. And the Bible says a soft answer turneth away wrath. And so let Jesus drive your soul today. May the Lord bless and keep you.